Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good morning. So today we will continue our class. We will discuss formative exercise 2.2 number 30. Okay, given y equal to 4x minus 3 over x squared plus 1. Find dy over dx. Okay, what is dy over dx? And determine the range of the values of x such that all the values of y and dy over dx are positive. Okay, this will cari dy dx. Kemudian range of x berapa? Value of y greater than 0 and dy over dx also greater than 0. Okay. So first kita cari dulu dy over dx. So dy over dx ini adalah uh, kita ada dah belajar dua. Quotient and product. Product rule and quotient rule. So ini adalah quotient rule. U over v. So u equal to 4x minus 3 and v equal to x squared plus 1. So du over dx equal to 4. dv over dx equal to 2x. So quotient rule dy over dx equal to v du over dx minus u dv over dx over v squared. This is the formula. Okay, we substitute into formula x squared plus 1. du over dx is 4 minus u 4x minus 3. dv over dx is 2x over v squared. v squared is x squared plus 1 to the power of Okay, we simplify. This is a 4x squared plus 4 minus, okay, yang ini, 4x times 2x is 8x squared. Minus, minus and minus. This is minus and minus, so plus. 3 times 2, 6x. Over x squared plus 1 to the power of 2. Okay, simplify lagi. Kita boleh... Uh, the side there. Eh? 4x squared minus 8x squared negative 4x squared plus 6x plus 4 over x squared plus 1 to the power of 2. Okay, ini uh, jawapan untuk dy over dx. Kita tak boleh simplify dah. Kalau kita factorize 2 pun. Okay, awak nak factorize 2, negatif 2 boleh juga. Kalau awak nak factorize kan jadi begini pun boleh. Negatif 2, here x squared, uh, 2x squared. Okay, minus, ni negatif dah keluarkan. Minus 3x minus 2 over x squared plus 1 to the power of 2. Nak factorize ini pun boleh. Tinggalkan macam ni pun tak apa. Okay. Next. Uh, range of x. When dy over dx greater than 0. Sorry. Okay, ini dah masuk inequality. dy dx greater than 0. Dan lagi satu dia beri syarat y greater than 0. Ayat dia dia beri dua eh. Satu dy dx greater than 0. Lagi satu y greater than 0. So, 
saya ambil dulu dy over dx. Ni saya ambil negatif 2. Ni yang saya factorize tadi. Over x squared plus 1 to the power of 2 greater than 0. Saya selesaikan yang left hand side dulu. So yang ini bila saya darab dia jadi negatif 2. 2x squared minus 3x minus 2 greater than 0. Okay. Yang ni saya simplify 2x squared minus 3x minus 2 greater than 0. So kalau you tekan calculator, ini adalah quadratic equation. Inequality. Nak cari x. Okay. Guna EQN. Try cari. Ni 2. So A dia 2. Sama dengan B negatif 3. Sama dengan C negatif 2. Sama dengan. So nanti you will get X equal to uh, Teacher. Uh -huh. The negative 2 must bring to the other side become divide right? Or how yeah. the No down. Yeah. Ah that one. Uh -huh. Where the negative 2 went? Send to the other side. divide by negative 2. Then must it's change zero. change the sign, right, teacher? Because divide oh, yes. by negative. Ah, ah. yes. Good. This is uh, less than 0. Should be less than 0. Because we will divide with negative 2. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, we get uh, negative 1 over 2. And one more. X equal to negative 2, correct? Correct. Eh, sorry, 2, 2, 2, oh. negative 2. 2, right? Yes. Yes. So, this is 2X plus 1 and X minus 2. Less than, less than 0. Ini bawa sini jadi 2X. Okay, ni 2X. Tolak, bring to the left hand side become plus. So 2x plus 1. 2. Bring to the left hand side become x minus 2. So here is x minus 2. Okay. So we get the answer. For first inequalities, negative 1 over 2. This is 2. Okay, look at the last inequalities, quadratic inequalities. The last quadratic inequalities. This is the last one. Okay. 2. The value of A is 2. When A equal to 2, A positive. So the graph should be U shape. The graph is U shape. So this is U shape. And we want less than 0. So less than 0 down. The inequalities, for the first inequalities, negative 1 over 2. Here is x and 2 at the right hand side. And here is less. Negative half less than x, less than 2. Okay, this is the inequalities for the first uh, first point. First information. Okay, next. Sampai sini boleh faham? Boleh. Okay, next. Can teacher. Y greater than zero. Okay. Y greater than zero. Y is 4x minus 3 over x squared plus 1 greater than zero. So we bring to the right hand side, we multiply with x squared plus 1, so it becomes 0. This is 4x minus 3, so x is 3 over 4. Okay, we have two inequalities. We need to combine these inequalities. So we combine... We have negative uh, 1 over 2 and here 3 over 4 
And here two. This is number line eh. Awak ikut number line. Kiri mesti nombor yang lebih kecil. So negative two. Three over four. Two. Okay. Kemudian buat yang ini dulu. Yang tanda yang ini dulu. Yang pertama. Negative half. Negative one over two. Until two. Negative one over two. Until two. Tu sini. Okay. Ini untuk yang pertama tadi. Kemudian X greater than 3 over 4. Sini. Kita cari intersection. So intersection antara dua ni. So, kita. Ini adalah X. Okay yang kita lori ini adalah X. So X di tengah. X di tengah. X di sini. So the left hand side X is 3 over 4. And here right hand side is 2. Bila X di tengah, tanda inequalities kita sentiasa akan jadi kurang. Less. Bila X di tengah, tanda inequalities akan jadi kurang. Tak ada tanda sama sebab sini tak ada hitam. Kalau tanda hitam maknanya ini ada tanda sama. Okay. So sampai sini untuk number 13. Boleh faham? Boleh. Okay. Ada nak tanya apa-apa? Okay. Tak ada. Next number uh, 14. Number 14. Given y equal to x minus 2 over x squared plus 5. Find the range of values of x. Okay, dia nak range of x. Such that y and y negative. So dy over dx also negative. So kita cari dy over dx. Sama juga ini adalah quotient rule. U over V. So u equal to x minus 2, v equal to x squared plus 5. So du over dx equal to 1. dv over dx equal to 2 bawah depan jadi 2x. So dy over dx equal to jadi v du over dx minus u dv over dx over V squared. So V X squared plus 5 substitute DU over DX is 1. Tak tulis pun tak apa. Sat dah tulis lah. Selamat ni kita tulis. Sebab biasanya pemeriksa dia akan beri markah apabila penggantian nilai yang betul pada rumus yang betul. So sini kalau you tak buat satu dia tak tahu you gantikan nilai. So nak bagi tahu dia yang kita gantikan nilai, kita kena tulis. Selamatnya awak tulis. Walaupun dia tak ada ubah apa-apa pun, tapi kita tulis je dulu. Okay, u x minus 2, dv dx is 2, x over v squared. Okay, yang ini saya expand, dia akan jadi x squared plus 5. Okay. Kemudian yang ini... Murid akan confuse di sini. 2X darah X. 2X kuasa 2. 2X kuat. Tapi ini ada negatif. So jangan lupa negatif. Kemudian 2X times 2 is 4X. Ini negatif. Tapi negatif ni perlu darab dengan sini. So negatif and negatif become positive. positive. Okay. So this is X kuat plus 5 power of so x squared minus 2 x squared negative x squared plus 4 x plus 5 over x squared plus 5 power of 2. Okay that is dy over dx. 
kita nak buat macam tadi pula dy dx less than 0 y less than 0 okay, tadi dia beri syarat dy over dx less than 0 and y less than 0 so, saya gantikan negatif x squared plus 4x plus 5 over x squared plus 5 to the power of 2 less than 0. Okay. So yang ini saya darabkan. Saya darab ke kanan. Dia jadi kosong sebab darab dengan kosong. So yang tinggal negatif x squared plus 4x plus 5 less than 0. Okay. Negatif. Kalau you nak buat pemfakturan negatif ni Tak selamat ada di depan. So kita jadikan dia positif. So saya darat dengan negatif satu. Ingat eh kalau quadratic equation ke quadratic inequalities ke before you use factorization, factorization make sure the coefficient of A is positive. So daratkan dengan negatif satu. Saya dapat x squared plus become minus plus become minus and here macam tadi kita darat dengan negatif number become greater. Okay, so factorize x, x, 5, 1 minus plus. You boleh guna calculator, you will get x equal to negative 1 and x equal to 5. Okay, sekarang kita nak cari dia punya jawapan. Inequalities untuk first case. Negative 1, 5. So yang ini, u atau n shape. Kita tengok kepada... The last quadratic inequalities. Quadratic inequalities yang paling akhir. Kita tengok yang ini. Okay. A kita A. A kita adalah satu. A sama dengan satu. Positif. So U shape. So the graph is U shape. Greater than zero. So letak sini. So A. Uh, sorry. Bukan A. Kita X kan. X less than negative one. And x greater than 5. Okay Zizin. Kalau you tak buat number line. You nak guna apa? Ada cara lain yang you boleh tunjukkan. Macam mana dapat ni? You guna cara apa? Dia ada cara lain. You uh, still juga. Uh, terus tulis je jangan. Mesti ada ini. Ha, mesti ada ini. Walaupun ini ayat uh, ketua pemeriksa uh, apa sebelum ni. Dia pernah pesan pada saya. Dia kata walaupun markah tak ada di sini. Tapi untuk tunjukkan jawapan ini perlu ada ini. Okay. Ha, ini jambatan dia. Walaupun tak ada markah di sini. Tapi ini kena tunjuk. Yeah. Okay. Okay next. Y less than zero. Y. Y tadi apa? Y tadi x minus two over x squared plus five. Less than zero. So saya bawa ke kanan. Darabkan dia jadi kosong. So x less. X minus two less than zero. So x less than two. So we need to combine dua ni. We need to combine dua ni. Two inequalities. Okay. So when we combine. Cari sikit. We nampak nanti. So when we combine. Buat satu garis lurus. Uh, satu garis nombor. This is negative one. Two. Five. So negative one ini. Less than. Ni, X less than negative 1. So, tanda ke kiri. X greater than 5. Tulis, lukis sebaris ya. Eh, sebab dia pada kes yang sama. Dia pada kes yang sama. So, lukis sebaris. Okay, lukis sebaris. Yang ni, X less than 2. So, ini yang lain. Kes yang lain. So, lukis sebaris. Eh, lukis baris lain. Okay, nampak intersection tak kat situ? Nampak kan? Ada intersection kan? Intersection dua line yang ini. Sampai negatif satu ni. So conclusion kita X less than negative 
one. Boleh faham? Boleh. Okay. 